Alrighty guys, what's going on? Linky here. And in today's video, we are going to be talking about the brand new Avatar story that was just officially announced. Dawn of Yang Chen is a brand new Avatar novel in the Chronicles of the Avatar series, where we're going to be learning about the airbending Avatar before Aang. So that being said, let's jump right into things. Now it has certainly been a while since I've uploaded an Avatar video to the channel. If you guys have been around since last summer though, you will know that I do want to cover Avatar as a franchise here. We're going to be getting into a lot of new content as the next couple years unfold with Avatar Studios now creating brand new animated content and overseeing novels and comic books and other forms of media within the franchise. And one of the first things that we're getting out of this new Avatar Studios era is the third Avatar novel. Now, if you guys are unaware, over the last couple years, we actually got two canon novels on Avatar Kyoshi. These were written by FCE in consultation with Mike and Brian, the guys who created Avatar and are running Avatar Studios. And they tell the story of Kyoshi's early years, how she dealt with problems in the Earth Kingdom, and how she eventually realized that she was the Avatar. In the second book, we learn about her dealings in the Fire Nation, and we get more information on her companion Rangi. Those books are fabulous. They are canon to the Avatar world. They're in consultation with Michael Dante DiMartino specifically. He's the one who helps consult FCE on the lore and new information that they're using for these books. And he is now back with his third novel and is going to be the first of a couple novels on Avatar Yang Chen. Avatar Yang Chen, for those of you who do not know, is the airbending avatar who came before Aang. In the avatar cycle, if you count backwards, it goes Korra, who's the most current avatar, then Aang, then Roku, then Kyoshi. After, uh, before Kyoshi was Avatar Kurok, and then before Avatar Kurok, it was Avatar Yang Chen. We're going to learn all about her backstory in these books. In the official description, they talk about how this is the first of a couple Yang Chen novels. We don't know specifically how many we're going to get, but considering Avatar Kyoshi got two, it would be safe to say Avatar Yang Chen is probably going to get two or maybe three, depending on the story that FCE wants to tell. In the description, we learn about Avatar Yang Chen's dealings with an Earth Kingdom city called Bin Ur, and in Bin Ur, there is a group of merchants who no longer want to be aligned with the Earth King of the day, and using a massive weapon of ultimate destruction, they are going to attempt to gain full control over this city and no longer be aligned with the Earth King in Ba Sing Se. This is interesting, it's not a ton of information, but it does give us a little bit of context as to what Yang Chen is going to be dealing with. Now, if you have read the Avatar Kyoshi novels, you will know that at this point in time during Kyoshi's era, Avatar Yang Chen is a revered avatar. She is a legendary avatar in the world. She is seen as the shining example of what an avatar should be at their height of power and at their height of influence on the world. But we also learn in those novels that Avatar Yang Chen wasn't perfect. While she made life for the humans incredibly prosperous, she did not pay as much attention as she should have to the spirit world, and that led to a lot of problems during Avatar Kurok's era that led to his early death. All of that is fleshed out in the Kyoshi novels, and I would highly recommend anybody who's an Avatar fan to go pick them up and read them. There's also audiobook versions if you're not a big reader. They are fabulous. Probably the best bit of Avatar story content outside of the two TV shows. I would highly recommend them. They are incredible. Now, before going any further, I just wanted to mention that the vast majority of you guys who are watching these videos and hopefully enjoying them aren't subscribed to the channel now, of course. Subscribing is free and you can unsubscribe anytime. And if you do subscribe, be sure to turn that notification bell on so you never miss another upload. That is all the official information that we have so far on Avatar Yang Chen and the Dawn of Yang Chen novel. It's going to be releasing on July 19th of this year, and just like with the Kyoshi novels, there's going to be a special edition that is exclusive to Barnes & Noble stores if you live in the United States. I don't know other countries where Barnes & Noble is based, but I know here it is the, uh, the major uh, brick-and-mortar bookseller in the United States. So there's going to be an exclusive one there, uh, probably with a bunch of extra pages of art and author information. That's usually what they do with these novels. In the future, uh, I'm going to be making more videos on these books. I would love to delve into new information, new pages, new preview pages as we get them. I really want to do a deep dive into these novels because 
I feel that the Kyoshi novels didn't get as much love as they should have. They weren't as widely celebrated. Everybody who read them, who realized they existed, have absolutely loved them. They are more mature. Uh, tellings of the Avatar world. They hit on those same adult themes that Avatar The Last Airbender did, but they don't skirt around them as much for the sake of it being a kid show. They deal with them directly. It also did a lot of really good work fleshing out Kyoshi's character. Uh, she had a bit of a stereotype in the Avatar fandom as the aggressive, wanting to kill people all the time Avatar. And while she does have that ruthlessness, she also is pushed to that ruthlessness because of people who just honestly there aren't a lot of other options for how to handle them, and a lot of that gets explained in the novels. She's not just killing people because it's her her baseline. She has to just to get to that point. So they do a really good job of fleshing her out. I would highly recommend them, and I want to cover Dawn of Yang Chen and whatever novels come after that on this channel as well. If you guys are excited to see some coverage of the Dawn of Yang Chen and future Avatar novels and future Avatar Studios content, I would love for you to let me know down in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video in specific, please be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel so you never miss any other Avatar or Pokemon or Nintendo content in the future. And we're going to speculate to high heaven about this book. Uh, if you got, I don't want to spoil a ton from the novels for Kiyoshi because they do actually feature Yang Chen a bit in the, the second book, The Shadow of Kiyoshi. We get some conversations between Kiyoshi and Yang Chen, and we get some fleshing out of Yang Chen as a character that I think FCE, now that he's coming back for another novel, is going to definitely carry over into this one. So I'm really excited to see it. I'll probably do specific videos detailing that stuff, but I don't want to spoil it in this announcement video for you guys if you haven't read it already. So like I said before, be sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed. I've been Linky, and we'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.